give it up for the next comedian of the evening, Mr. Dave Schneer! My name is Dave Schneer and I am from Kentucky. Yeah! <laughs> I'd like to start you all off tonight with a Kentucky State salute. Oh! Oh! Come on, Scottsdale! Oh! Yeah! And <laughs> hey, you know we all have those who must live by and so does a hillbilly. I like to refer to that man as a hillbilly rules of etiquette. Rule number one, you're not required to wash your hands after you piss in the sink. <laughs> after you cut the grass, it's okay to smoke it. <laughs> the only time your woman should not swallow is when she's chewing tobacco. <laughs> I'm sitting in my condo, newly divorced. This cat keeps coming to my back door. She keeps coming back, keeps coming back, keeps coming back. Finally, I let her in. I've got to be more specific about my prayers. Yeah. I come home from work one day, the cat's on the internet. <laughs> Playing with the mouse and shit, you know? I look at the screen, she's looking at kitty porn. <laughs> I immediately notify Joe Paterno. <laughs> yeah. Nothing's happened to her yet. <laughs> Who out there's got a nickname? Oh, yeah. I'm a little kid, my nickname was Ears. I think my ears were born and my head grew into them. Yeah, everything was cool as a little kid. I was happy, you know, throwing crab apples at each other, having crab apple fights and shit, you know, till I went to kindergarten. The teacher's like, Dad, the teacher's like, son, what's your name? I said, my name is Ears. <laughs> she said, no, no, son, what's your Christian name? I said, I don't fucking know. <laughs> Pontius Pilate? <laughs> uh, hey, where's my drinkers tonight? Oh, woo! Another legal drinking age in Kentucky. Six. The third trimester. Yeah. I got into some trouble though. I was drinking one night at a party. I was 16. I fell over this two foot hedge. I hit my head. I cut my head open. I go to the hospital to get stitches. I'm in there getting stitches. I pass out. I go into respiratory arrest. Both my pupils fixed and dilated, and I went into a seizure. The doctor's talking to the brain surgeon on the phone. He says, hey, doc, I got a kid here. He's clinically brain dead. What should I do? The doctor says, operate on him. You can't kill him. <laughs> yeah. At this point, I'm glad I had not signed my organ donor card. Yeah. My liver might have ended up in this guy. <laughs> well on its way to cirrhosis. <laughs> People always ask me, Dave, what's it like to be dead? I'm like, it's really cool. <laughs> you hover over, I hovered over my body. I went down this long tunnel with a white light at the end. I go into the light. There's happiness, joy, and peace, and tranquility like I've never known. I don't feel like I deserve to be there. Yeah. I asked this line, I said, why do I get to be here? And this very peaceful voice comes out and says, because I love you. I'm like, wow, that's pretty heavy, man. 
<laughs> say, what the fuck do you expect me to say? I'm God! Yeah. How about it's not happy? I said, tell me how I can help you spread your word. How can I help you carry your message? He laughed at me. I said, Dave, I don't need your help. I'm God. I said, man, what do I do? What do I do? Tell me what to do. He said, just be you. Just be. I said, really? <laughs> I can just be me? Just be Dave from here? You mean fear is an illusion? The only real thing is love? Wow. Thank you. That really helped me. <laughs> so I asked this chick for a blowjob, right? Huh? I said, okay, would it help if I told you to shock the shit out of me if you suck my dick right now? Hey, my name's Dave Schneer, you got to do it.